Hello, welcome back to the channel. It's JPA here. In today's video, I'm going to talk about Rangers versus Celtic. Always, if you're new to the channel, please think about hitting that subscribe button, hit the like button as well, and we will be well on our way. We'll just get straight into this video, guys. So, Rangers versus Celtic tomorrow. Ibrox, I think it's a half 12 kickoff, if I'm right. Possibly 12. Uh, I really like doing the old firm videos because you always get loads of Celtic fans on these videos. So, hello, Celtic fans. How you doing? Uh, just pushing my views up, which is fantastic for me. Uh, yeah, it's going to be uh, another interesting game, uh, particularly coming off the back of that PSV defeat. Obviously, that was a, a heavy defeat for us. Uh, looking at Michael Bull's um, presser, there's not a lot of injuries. Uh, we uh, kind of thought that Barisic might have been it, but he's actually available for selection. Uh, it didn't mention Yilmaz, to be honest with you. Uh, but it says the likes of Kemar Roof, Tom Lawrence, the the guys are uh, in contention for a start. So you never know who who's going to play. Uh, he has to get this selection right, in my opinion. Uh, I don't think he got the possibly he got the team selection correct on uh, when was it Wednesday night, but he didn't get the the tactics right, in my opinion. So we're going to have to do something slightly different. I feel we play far too narrow. Uh, and as I've said in previous videos, uh, we need to get Tav and uh, Barisic, if, if, if indeed it is Barisic that's on the left. We need to give him the ball, give them the ball. Uh, Barisic, despite his fact he's, uh, he gets picked up for his defending, same with Tav. The, the, at the other end of the pitch are fantastic. Barisic is probably one of the best crossers of the ball I've ever seen. Uh, well, in today's game, let's not go too far. Obviously, Beck, you've got Beckham and stuff like that. But in terms of today's game, the modern game, Barisic is crossing his pinpoint accuracy. Brilliant. It's just that defensive side that lets him down. Same with Tav. Tav's fantastic going forward. The amount of assists and goals he gets for us is uh, just incredible. But they need help defensively when they're going forward to get that cover. Uh, so that's something that Michael Beale has to look at. And we don't want to be too narrow. This uh, diamond formation in the middle of the park doesn't seem to be working. We're going to have to do something else. Uh, and whether that's maybe play the two defensive midfielders, which we have done in the past, that's possibly what we could do. Right, normally in these videos, I look at the opposition as well and tell you a wee bit about their form and, and how they're doing. It's very difficult to tell with Celtic. Uh, obviously, their last couple of results haven't been that great. I think, in fact, they went two goal, uh, two games, sorry, without scoring a goal, which is very unlike Celtic. Very rare for that to happen. Uh, it's an old firm game; they're not going to uh, just kind of lie down and take it. Um, if Rangers play it the the way they played in the last old firm game, then I think we'll have no problems. A lot of Celtic fans will tell you, "Oh, Celtic had won the league; they didn't care about that game." That, that's absolute nonsense in my opinion. There's not a professional football player in the world. They'll go into an old firm game, uh, regardless of what the league status is or anything like that. They'll not go into an old firm game and just no care, no no give 100%. I'm not buying that. I think Rangers were better on that day. And we have to be at our best again to win this game. So I'm going to give you my prediction now. I do think Celtic will score. I'm going to go Rangers 3, Celtic 1. I think if we can get a really good start to the game, maybe even get an early goal, then it will unsettle them. Uh, we need to be in their faces. We need to be brave. Um, I'm not buying this thing that Celtic are not playing particularly well. That may well be the case, but uh, it's a Brendan Rodgers team, and Brendan Rodgers did really, really well the last time he was at Celtic. So I'm not... Thinking for a minute that Celtic are going to be an easy opposition for us, uh, by any means. Goal scorers for me, I'm going to stick with my man Tav, just simply, you just kind of write him off from scoring. Uh, I do, I'm going to back Dessers again to get a goal, and I think Danilo's going to come off the bench and score as well. So that's the video done guys, thank you very much for watching, uh, I'll see you in the next video, cheers.